Hello everybody, Galarian Sangby here, and welcome to the next episode. May I uh, remind you that I'm not that great at Kirby games, as much as I like their like their game music. music. I've already lost two lives. There's an extra life here. I don't know how on earth you get. Because I can't think of any immediate way to get it. But I somehow kept my treasures even though I died. And there goes poor Bunkers. Ow! Go away! You don't usually attack. Walla do, I want you to come here. Here, become cutter. Ow. Gimme mirror. Okay, now let's slide around and try and collect some more treasures. Be a little bit slow on here because rushing is what's getting me killed. There we go, you're dead. What are you? Are, do you count as a power? Okay. Okay, there's nothing down here. I forget if there's one you cannot cut. Okay. While he's busy... Oh, I didn't realize that the friend could grab onto you! I don't know if that has any practical use, but... And we got thieves around here. The bandana! Which I want to say that may be a reference to Street Fighter, because of you. Ow! Please kill enemies, Kirby. You're taking a godly amount of damage in this. Please cut it. Does this go anywhere? Oh god. I don't think this is blocking anything. Oh no, there's a chest and also a one-up. Springtime! Let's go back up. These thieves are getting annoying, though. Let's go in through the door. Okay, we haven't missed any treasures. Let's heal up. Cutter, you become sword. S become sword. Become... Okay, this is jet. Uh, let's take sword. And here we get to our first boss of Great Cave Offensive. It's a whale! Very circular whale that's actually kicking my ass, Jesus. Need to remember to guard. Ow. Oh! It can... And it just owned me. I thought that when it was swimming by like that, it doesn't do damage, but apparently I was wrong. Bring out, bring out Blade Knight. Here we go. Oop, okay, when it splashes, that forces you up no matter what and makes boulders fall. Just guard through that. Good, this guard doesn't have any ouch damage. Okay, we've barely done any damage to the boss. Where's the boss? I'm gonna shield myself. Woo! My helper's almost dead. My helper died but became stone. Or rocky as he's called. Ooh, food! Thank God! No, 
but my power. Power, come back here. Come on, he's one hit away. There we go. The whale is dead. And thank God for healing. Now let's ride a minecart. Let's go! Dee dee. Dee dee. Running over everybody that's in the way of the of minecart. Okay, this room. Also, something I want to mention. If you've heard of Great Cave Offensive outside of this game, you've probably played Smash Brothers, as it is a stage in both, if I remember correctly, the Wii U and Ultimate? If I remember correctly? Yeah, go down here and you'll find a treasure. The Dime, which is worth 10, 10 bucks. Go into here and get an extra life and another treasure. The Glass Slippers, which is not a reference to a game, but more so a reference to, um... Oh, what... Which Disney character am I thinking of? Uh, which fairy ca character am I thinking of? It's not Rapunzel. Uh... Crap! I can't remember what, what character it's a reference to, but it is a reference to a character. Now we got these rooms, which I think we do have to clear if we want to progress. Kirby, please. There we go. The Gauntlet. Oop. Did not want to go up. I want to check what's down. I will say Great Cave Offensive has... Great music. I forgot there was a chest that spawns in midair. Hang on, we're gonna have to leave and come back. If you do miss a chest, simply leaving the area and coming back will make it respawn. Also, just real quick, I wanna save here. Give me healing. Also, I'll give uh, Rocky Mirror so that way he's. Simulator? However, you say that name? Sima Mirror, I think is how you say it. Now, eat the bomb. So, I gotta remember that when I. So, I gotta remember that when I'm down there, just as I push the button, I gotta make a mad run to the center and open the chest. You got a saucepan. For 10 bucks. I don't know why that would be considered a treasure whatsoever. If it was Pikmin, then probably that would be a different story. Okay, I need to switch powers here. So I need something with range. I know one of these powers. There we go. The Brass Knuckles. Kirby with Brass Knuckles. He's gonna mess some things up. Get rid of this dude. The Amber Rose. Please hit the bomb. We haven't missed anything yet. Oh, there's wind in here. I was wondering why Kirby was moving so slow. Oh, that means getting in the door. There we go. I was about to say, please don't take forever to get into the door. Here we have fish fossil, which that could actually be worth something. And beast fossil. I, I believe this is a reference to Pokemon with the, um... 
with the helix and uh the helix fossil and the um Oh, I'm forgetting the act the name of the other fossil given the the but I believe that is a reference to Pokemon and How close those fossils are together and I believe the first book and I believe gen 1 would have been out at this point So I wouldn't be surprised if it was not a reference to Pokemon Uh, let me Okay, there's nothing up Just want to quickly check Oh, we got a bomb. Who we owned. Come here. Now I have the power of bombs. Nunchucks. Whoa, don't want to fall midair. Okay, what does this button do? Takes us back to the beginning. All right. So let's come up here and save on up. Uh, I think we have a little bit of time to do one more room. So let's do the center. Oh, we're swimming. Ooh, we can make it, we can make it, we can make it. No, we cannot. No matter how much you try, you're never gonna make it to that chest. That means we gotta find a way around. Ooh, yo. I want yo-yo. Sweet yo-yo. Well, at least we open a way to a maximum tomato. We gotta find our way to that. And the jet guy drowned because he went in the water. Some enemies will drown and die if they end up in the water. No, I'm not getting pushed away from the treasure chest. Swim, 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 swim. And we get a bucket. This bucket specifically has an M on it. I believe this is a reference to a game featuring Wario, where Wario would try to control Mario using a bucket. I think the game is called Mario and Wario. I forget the actual name of the game. I know it is a trophy. The bucket is a trophy in one of the Smash Brothers games. So one of the Smash games does tell you about it. Ow. Oh, that brings the current. And it's too late to heal our buddy. Kill Jet. Okay. I think this way... We're gonna try both ways. And my buddy just kills himself by landing on spikes. Again, Dream Friends allies. Much more smarter in their AI. Although I can't really blame it because this is like a Super Nintendo game and Dream Friend, Dream Friends, Dream Star Allies is like a Switch game so I can't really blame AIM this one for being a much older game. Summertime! And I honestly don't know if Superstar Ultra, the DS version of this game, fixes this AI to make it be a little bit more smarter. Okay, let's slide out. Okay. Swim up because this is going to lead us back to where we are. I'm an idiot. Give me yo-yo. As we get rammed by jet and I lose the power. Ah, I prioritized cutter. Oop. I don't want to die. I want to at the very least get to a save room. Oh, no, no, no. And I died anyway. At least I get to keep my treasures, but I lost my one up. Why am I dying so much in Great Cave Offensive? 
Well, I'm going to save, and in the next episode, we'll go back to collecting some more treasures. See you all next time. <laughs>